Tonight on Ideal Interiors, we go to Durable Electricals where we find an amazing world of LED lights and discover electricity-saving methods that will leave you breathless. We spend time with the PG Bison Training Center and delve into the world of MDF boards that have aptly been christened Superwood. We experience a revolutionary Crown Paints color visualizer that enables you to preview graphical images of how your room or surface would look like in different shades. Your host is Pete Openda, and our location is the glamorous Policina Interiors, where we spend time in a delightful coffee bar with the charming Pam Atieno. Nothing would ruin your day like having to run out of your home through the freezing rain to a local coffee shop, just to feel the ambience and aromas of fresh coffee. Why not skip the outdoor excursion and make your own coffee bar? When it comes to decor, function and beauty are always a possibility, and when they come together, you are likely to create your own little paradise. This is exactly what Pamatieno of Palacina Interiors showed Pete when they got together for refreshments in this magnificent coffee bar. Well, you're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, great. How would you like your coffee? Um, black and no sugar. Black and no sugar. And I can tell you this is just the place to be. Yeah, you know, we with uh, Palacina Interiors, we tend to give you that beautiful space that you want. Even from the bar area, we work with, you know, your budget. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and with uh, your design, mm -hmm. you give us, you tell us what you want and we'll give you that final look. Pete learned that when choosing your home decorations, it's important to try to stick to a general style theme and color palette. This way, you can pick pieces of different shapes, textures, size and design while maintaining a cohesive feel. And this coffee bar with a grey and silver palette has certainly captured this magical concept. You know, I had always told everybody that likes to see me and to meet with me, mm -hmm. that the best places for me in any house or any public space is a bar. Mm -hmm. But I had always thought about bars as a place where you serve alcoholic beverages. And here you're telling me about a coffee bar. Exactly. And I'm enjoying it. I'm glad you are, because, you know, not everybody does take alcohol. There are those who just want coffee or juices or you know just water. And to have a bar in the living room, it just makes the whole space quite beautiful. And you know what I really like about this one, it's done in grey and then you have all these brass and silvery colours that just yeah. completely complement it. You know the beauty of working with greys, it tends to go so well with silver. Can you imagine if we would have decided to use gold? How would that look? Yes, yeah, certainly there would have been a complete clash of colour. Exactly. That's why we decided to go with the silver and that kind of rustic kind of look to go well with the, with the greys and to go well with our accessories. Because you can see at the back we have glass, we have still the silver, kind of rustic silver look to it, just to complement the whole grey colour. And besides having a bar close to the living area, would you recommend for a bar to be located somewhere else in the house? Well, it's usually quite advisable to have a bar next to a living area because when you are entertaining your guests, assuming maybe the supper is not ready or dinner is not ready, your friends, your guests can move over to the bar and they can have their drinks there right next to the you know, dining area. So it's quite, uh, I would recommend for bars to be right next to a living room or next to a dining area. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, that's really nice. The thing about this one I notice is that it would be suitable for a place where you have lots of space in your living area. Are you able to do them in different sizes? Yes, we can work with whatever size of space you have in your in your home. You don't have to have a large space, you know, to have a uh, to have a bar. You can have a small space. Then we would work with that space, and then to give you that perfect bar that you're looking for in your home. Now, just coming back to this bar, I mean, you told me about the pendant lighting. Why wouldn't you then have your normal chandelier here? Well, the thing is, well, at the bar, a normal chandelier, because you know a chandelier is just a branched out lighting. Well, we, what you were looking for in the bar, you need that direct light over whatever you're serving at the counter. 
and with the chandelier you you we call them this these are also still chandeliers but they're called pendant chandelier pendant. because they give you that direct light onto the counter to see what you're serving and also to give you that ref reflection on the counter in the end home decor is all about you and your family whether you go for a traditional or modern look Choose pieces that speak to your passions and create spaces that make you happy. This coffee bar and the aromatic coffee served by Pam Atieno has certainly brought warmth to this space. Right, thank you very much for now. May I also partake of your cookies because this coffee is really nice. This is the good life. Next, the lovely Julia Aviambo of Crown Paint introduces us to Metallica paint, textured surfaces, and the magical Crown Paints color visualizer. Have you ever thought about why you find one place appealing and are uneasy with another? Why you are attracted to one product over another? Color whether architectural or in products, accounts for 60% of our response to an object or a place. To get an insight into what color is all about, Pete took a trip to Crown Paint and spent some time with the lovely Julia Aviambo, who gave him an insight on textured paint, metallic paint, and color. So among our textured paints, for the interior, we have our rough and tough, as the name suggests, it's very rough, as you can feel it. And the beauty about it, our rough and tough comes in a standard color, so you can splash on it any color of your choice. It's a very durable product, ideally for exterior, but you can also use it on your interior if you wanna create a textured finish in your space. And also we have our crown stone variation. Crown stone variation also comes in a range of colors for you to select from. Very durable product, ideal for high-risk buildings, but you can still use it on your interior as well to give you that textured finish you're looking for. And uh, we have our elephant skin. As you can see, the name comes from, from the skin of the elephant itself, you know, the African elephant. And basically, you just play around. You can, you can combine different colors depending on how you know you want to achieve your texture. For this one particularly, we have applied a black matte finish and then touched up with a copper. Crown Metallica copper paint. But talking about copper, yes. I remember Rakesh telling me about the textured paints and then he said something about metallic type paints. Yes, actually we have quite a variety of metallic paints and textures actually. We have quite a variety. You can play around with different combinations, different colors for your base coat and top coat. And in some instances actually you can mix up three to four colors. So you can have one base coat and play around with two top coats and actually the top coats like I said are embedded with metal which is either copper gold and silver. Apart from the elephant skin we have the crinkle effect actually it's an effect that is made from a crinkle paper. Crinkle paper is a tissue like paper but it's fine and then you can just you stick to it your crinkle stick to your base coat while it's still wet and then touch up you can either touch up with copper gold or metal to give it a very beautiful finish. So here we have the metallic catalog. It gives you the options and some of the special effects we have. I'll tell you what, this is all very exciting. I'm so just taken in by the textured paints, the metallic paints. But, you know, how do I arrive at a color? I mean, I, I'm trying to visualize my house right now and it's very difficult to pick up color combinations. How would you do that? Julia introduced Pete to the revolutionary Crown Color Visualizer. This is an application that enables you to preview graphical images of how different surfaces and rooms are likely to look in the event that you are repainting or doing a new paint job altogether. You can actually do that from the comfort of your home. We have a visualizer online. Go to our website, crownpaints.co.k. You can find a visualizer and actually you can navigate through. It can help you put different colors together. And also here, I mean, I'll, 
with the use of our screen, this one can help you actually. For instance, we have you have the suggestions of the interiors, exteriors, and the different textures as well. You can play around with it. In the past, customers of Crown Paints and Prospects had no way to picture or imagine how a particular surface or room would look like when a particular finish was applied to it. This app allows you to preview or visualize how your room or surface will look like with different shades to help you decide. And as Pete found out, it is user-friendly and very easy to manipulate. So you pick the color you want, that is the coral expression. It gives you that shade and uh, what you do, just do pick and drop. It pastes exactly the color you want. Great. Yeah, there you go. The Crown Paints Visualizer includes functions such as manipulation of customer pictures to provide previews, social media sharing, print and save facilities, sharing of your images through Google, Facebook and Twitter, and you do not have to personally visit a Crown Paints facility to access the app. You can simply register by Gmail or Facebook or log in on the Crown Paints website from the comfort of your home. After the break, we make some mind-boggling energy-saving discoveries at Durable Electricals and go to the training center at PG Bison where we learn about the magical superword. The Ideal Interiors Expo has in the past six years grown to become the premier event of the interiors industry in East Africa. And now, introducing Ideal Interiors Expo 2016. Are you an interior supplier of furniture and furnishings, kitchens and accessories, bathrooms, wall finishes, lighting, flooring and many more? Well, it is your chance to exhibit at the region's finest expo on interiors for homes, offices and hotels. Book your space now. The Ideal Interiors Expo, setting standards in the interiors industry. If you're considering a decorating project, you've probably given a lot of thought to furniture style, colors, and materials. But what about lighting? This important part of your decorating scheme can enhance colors, spark drama, and create a mood. But good lighting is about more than pretty fixtures. To find this out, Pete took a trip to Durable Electricals where he met Ken, the knowledgeable electrical engineer who not only enlightened him but introduced him to a whole new world of energy, saving and lighting techniques. Um, perhaps you could just begin by telling me what is Durable Electricals Limited? What do you do? As our motto goes, we, we complete what you have started. Uh, mostly on residential, in residential homes, we do decorative products uh, with energy saving in mind. We have a, a machine system that we are able, to, in comparison to your bills, we are able to come and uh, do an energy audit in your building, see your consumption and see how much you are consuming and see how we can change and reduce the consumption uh, of your building, especially in commercial buildings, hospitals and hotels. Energy audit. I'm used to financial audit. What's this? Yes, but energy, uh, energy audit is where we compare uh, uh, halogen lamps, halogen lighting, uh, incandescent lighting, the normal bulbs, and uh, halide lighting, especially for street lighting and commercial lighting. So we compare this with the same amount of illumination in terms of LED. So LED lighting is different lighting that consumes less, but gives the same amount of illumination as halogen or incandescent or highlight lighting would give you. Now Ken, you have been talking about energy saving all along and you have been mentioning LED lamps as an advantage over, for example, halogen lamps or your normal lamps in the home. Uh, would you care to explain to me what are these advantages that LED lamps have over the other lamps from energy consumption to perhaps cost? Uh, LED lighting, that is light emitting diodes, uh, give the same, consume less voltage and consume less power. 
as compared to other forms of lighting, uh, uh, from energy, uh, energy saving bulbs to fluorescent tubes to halogen lamps to uh, halide lamps. Uh, LED lighting is a new thing. It is a way to go right now. This is all just sounding so magnificent. In fact, it's sounding unbelievable. I am your typical Kenyan. Seeing is believing. How can you prove all that you're saying to me actually happens? Uh, I would like to show you, uh, uh, demonstrate to you, uh, in comparison, a few of the lights that we have, LED, a few of the LED lights that we have, in comparison to the normal incandescent lamps that we usually have around. And I would like you to see for yourself the kind of saving that you will be receiving. Ken, I certainly want to see that. <laughs> Please. Ken introduced Pete to an interesting gadget that enables you to do an energy audit that shows how much power individual lights and other electrical appliances are consuming in your home. Before we do the energy audit with another set of system, which we, we actually go to the energy, uh, to the power system itself, this is what we use to, to show you what, what kind of lighting you're using and what we want to replace to you and the kind of savings that you will be getting. Yes. So what in effect you're telling me is that if you have a lower wattage on a bulb, then it consumes less electricity. Exactly. Ken, this certainly is a wonderful gadget that would help to resolve many of the challenges we have with lighting in Kenyan homes. So Pete, that's about it. Uh, one thing I would also like to mention is that uh, the energy analysis uh, machine is, is very portable and we can come with it anywhere at your commercial building or at your home and we can do the same kind of demonstration. Pete, being the doubting Thomas, asked to visit customers who had taken Ken's advice and made the switch to LED lighting to see the benefits. Hello. Hello. Welcome to my home. Thank you very much yes, indeed. Yes. I'm Good very happy Sana. for you having me here. Welcome. At Helen's house where Pete made his first stop, the amount of saving that Helen had made by making the big switch was mind-boggling. Durable Electricals came here and they did an energy audit because I thought, I thought my power bills were too, too high. They were between 15,000 all the way to 18, 19,000. Goodness. Yes. So I needed to find out what we need to do mm -hmm. to come up with a solution because I was finding it hard to pay all those power bills. So they came and did an audit. We were using energy saving bulbs and uh, some halogen bulbs on the chandeliers. Mm -hmm. So they came and told us which bulbs to use. Mm -hmm. So once we changed the bulbs, the next power bill mm -hmm. from 18,000 came to 7,000. What? Instant. From 18,000 yes. to 7,000? Yes, 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 yes. Pete followed this up with a visit to Radiant Hospital and the figures spoke for themselves. The savings were unbelievably huge. Uh, previously, we were spending up to 110,000 per month, uh, yet we were not even as busy as we are now on, on power. But uh, currently, our bills are from about 25 up to 40,000 maximum. 25,000? Yes. From up, over 100,000? Yes, yes. That's a huge 100. saving. A very huge saving. And uh, I count it all to LED. Even if you think of decorative lighting as architectural jewelry, remember, all your electrical costs can come down drastically by using the right equipment. In this case, genuine LED lamps. Durable electricals will also provide an energy audit in your home or business, enabling you to make the right choices for all your energy needs. Next, we go to the training center at PG Bison, where we learn about the magical medium density fiberboard Superwood. Pete was back at PG Bison to take a look at their training center and he met with Joseph, the training manager, who took him through the nitty-gritty of panel boards. Pete was truly fascinated by what was on offer. As the name suggests, the particle board is made up of uh, ground timber, which has been grounded to particles. And then they have been boarded together using some resin. Similarly, with the MDF, it is the same, same wood that has been crushed into a fibrous form and then it is binded together with some resin and then becomes one thing, a homogeneous thing that has got all the attributes of live wood. When we manufacture the MDF, 
We break the wood fibrous foam and then we constitute it together to make it look like wood. Whenever we are doing screws on the particle board, be it on the head and be it on the face, they hold better than when we do it onto the MDF. So is if, this a particle board? This is particle board and we've tried to drive through a screw without any pilot hole on the end and there is no splitting because we have the coarse material there which makes the fruits of the screw to hold tightly and hold better. When screws are used, MDF boards have a challenge in comparison to particle boards. Pete then took a detailed look at PG Bison's multi-purpose wood-based product, Superwood, and so what makes it special and why it's so perfect for the most important people, PG Bison's customers and their customers' customers. Superwood is PG Bison's leading brand of medium density fiber board, commonly known as MDF. It is used on furniture doors for shop fittings, picture framing, decor, and many other applications. Superwood has a homogeneous or uniform structure with the fibers packed tightly together and have no core voice. This is what gives it performance characteristics such as its ability to be routed, shaped, and turned, making it so much more than just a flat panel product. The tightly packed fibers also improve its impact resistance. It's available in standard sizes, so there is less wastage, and with thicknesses from 3 mm to 30 mm, you have the flexibility to create something simple or intricate using standard woodworking tools. You do not have to worry about grains, nuts or differing densities. Superwood has the best characteristics of natural wood without the limitations. So most of the traditional woodworking joints you would use with solid timber can be successfully used on Superwood. And like natural timber, Superwood is non-directional which means you can cut it in any direction. A high speed and a clean feed will help you get the cleanest cut from your superwood. Using a scoring blade will make it that much cleaner. Remember also to keep your tools sharp. Blunt saw blades can cause damage during cutting. The sharper the tools, the better the cut. Machine nailing, screwing or stapling are all recommended for superwood. Hand nailing is not ideal. If you are using nails or staples, choose the resin coat variety. The glue effect of the resin coat offers a firm hold for a long period of time. Superwood also holds screws exceptionally well. Drilled pilot holes have far better holding power of the screw than punched pilot holes. Remember to use only straight chunk screws with superwood as this will prevent splitting. For bigger jobs, use longer rather than thicker screws. When superwood comes off the production line, its ready surface is ideal for processes such as laminating, foiling, veneering and printing. Superwood is sanded to a fine smooth finish, providing a great surface for spray painting and PVC wrapping. Always ensure that the surface is always free of residual dust to stop inclusions or bumps. For additional sanding, make sure you use a high-speed sanding belt. Slow belt speeds only bend the surface fibers rather than cleanly cutting them off. This gives the board a fairy appearance and feel. PG Bison Superwood is truly a blank canvas and thanks to their constantly improving plant and systems, it allows you to create whatever is in your imagination. So the next time you are thinking of creating something out of this world, think no further than PG Bison Superwood. At the end of the training, Pete caught up with Anthony Bett, who reinforced the message of product quality and was only too happy to gift him a PG Bison board pack that contains all the different boards available. Which includes the veneers and the plain ones. And we have about 17 uh, MDF colors. Just by looking at this box, you can also see the kind of value additions we can add to the product after you buy it. We can also cut it and edge it for you. So Pete from PG Bison, this is your box. Thank you very much. You're most welcome.